Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be talking all about my experience with the Extreme Lash 4-Day Course. I'm going to link the Extreme Lash website down below so you guys can check out their products, what they're all about, and also um, if you're thinking about enrolling in a class for yourself, you can check that all out on their website. You'll be able to see like the prices, if a class is coming to an area near you, and all of that. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you my at-home kit, which I received in the mail. It's sitting over there. I'm so excited to share that with you guys. And then I'm going to be taking you guys through each day doing a little recap of what I do during the day inserting some pictures of my work and then I'm also going to be showing you guys my kit that I receive at school and then I'll just do an overall like how I felt about the class and all of that so yeah let's just start today's video there is so much stuff in here that I have to show you guys so I'm super excited about that So there's a ton of stuff in here. I've tried to organize it to the best of my abilities. So the kit came with a couple makeup items by their brand, Extreme Lash. I was not expecting to get makeup in the kit, so I was very excited when I saw all this makeup. This first thing is just a little compact mirror. You also get an Extreme Lash um, pencil sharpener, their volumizing mascara. You're also going to get their length and volumizing mascara, which is different than the last one. This one is length and volume, and this one is just volume. You're also going to receive all four of their glide shadow sticks. Mahogany, champagne, chocolate, and bronze. Liquid liner in dark brown, also the liquid liner in black. The brow pen in deep brown. Brown, glide liner stick in the color gold, an eyeshadow primer, skin renewing concealer, and a black eyeliner pencil. To go with the makeup, you're going to receive two full size eye makeup remover and facial cleansers. This could hold like pens, it could also hold makeup brushes or um, tools that you might need. One total eye repair serum. You also receive this dietary supplement. This is called Amplify and it just helps you grow like healthy lashes, brows, and hair. So this is basically just like a hair growth supplement. It comes with two bottles. This is what they look like. Also, you receive one Amplify Advanced Lash and Brow Fortifier. So this is just like a growth serum for your brows and your lashes. This is what it looks like. These are a bunch of registration forms, um, client history forms, just stuff that you're going to want your clients to fill out prior to getting their lash extensions. Also, in the kit, you get a whole bunch of like knowledge booklets that you can hand out to your clients. So you get a little beauty book, a booklet all about their concealer, booklets about their eyeliner, more booklets about their eyeliner, booklets about their growth serum, total eye repair serum, aftercare guides, and eyelash knowledge. I also received some extreme lash bags and 15% off little cards. Also to hold the booklets, you're gonna get these little stands. You can just set them like if you have an eyelash room or at the salon you're working at, you can use these to prop up the booklets. A hundred medicine cup. Just use these to put products in while you're doing your eyelashes. It's just more sterile this way. You're also gonna receive this clear little plastic bag. Inside, it's just a whole bunch of different applicator styled brushes. The first is just little disposable lash brushes. A three pack of these flex tip applicators. Two packs of of the lint free applicators and lastly three packs of the long tip applicators I was so excited when I saw this bag because it's so cute. It just looks like this and it has the little gold plaque that says Extreme Lashes and I just think the bag's really cute and it's such good quality. It has a back pocket, so it has this front zipper pocket and then this inside is just the main pocket. These actually can Velcro off so you can have separate mini bags. In the first little bag, I just have some under eye patches, one pack of the silicone under eye patches, one pack of the lint free gel patches, and two packs of the hydrating under eye gel patches. In the next little pouch here, it's kind of just like a first aid kit. You're going to get one bottle of eye wash solution, tape, two packs of the alcohol prep pads. The last section that pops off the Velcro is a long bag, and this just has some extra eyelash stuff, a lash grid 20 pack of adhesive trays, square well adhesive trays, adhesive remover, eyelash primer, protective coating, and a pack of multi-purpose wipes. This side just came with a bunch of lash palette sponges, so I will take guys through those. Three packs of the six by six sponge palette, two packs of these cosmetic sponges. So that was everything that was in this cute little bag. I also forgot to mention that it has a front pocket where you're able to keep a license and maybe some pens. And now for the most important part of the whole lash kit, it wouldn't be complete without the eyelashes. So you also get this cute little bag, which also has a gold plaque that says extreme lashes. Are you guys ready for the lashes? This is so exciting. These are the bold mink, two mink X wrap in matte and these are all different millimeter sizes um, but I'll learn more about that when I go to class more bold lashes they just look like this more X wraps and this one is super fun these are just some colors 
These look really cool when you mix them with black so you can just get some sort of hint of a color maybe when the sunlight hits them. So that kit has a thousand dollar value and in your kit you will also receive a receipt. I didn't want to show up because my address was on it but it has a list of everything you're receiving and the price of that item. So now let's go to class. Good morning guys, it is 6.15 and it's time for me to leave for my class. I just have a huge dilemma because I think I have to drive on the highway to get to my class. Um, I don't really drive on the highway, I've never really done it. I'm very nervous about the drive, honestly. I wish that like, I could get an Uber. <laughs> I drove on the highway guys, this is like, I don't even know what the word is. Crazy. I stopped at Starbucks, I feel like this is turning into my last drive through video but i got the salted caramel mocha bacon gouda i think i'm gonna take the bacon off though because it's always like soggy so i'm just gonna rip that off i just cleaned the back of my car because i'm thinking i'm gonna go to lunch and if anyone wants to come with me which i'm sure no one's gonna want to i just clean my back seat in case like i drive and i don't want to look like a slob. I just got to the place. It's actually in a casino and there's so many entrances. I have no idea where to go. I honestly don't think I can record in the class. It said absolutely no video recording. So I guess that would mean I can't record, but um, I will try as best I can to get all the footage I can and I'll definitely insert pictures if I do anything. So I just got out of class. I tried to film as much as I can, but they were like very strict on filming being like not a thing. I'm gonna insert the clips that I got somewhere over here. I met everyone in my class. They were all super nice. Um, we all just got along, so that was nice. Also today we got half of our student kit because the first half of it's gonna last us the first two days and then the second half of it is gonna last us the days three and four. Basically what was in our student kit was just like smaller versions of what was in the kit that I showed at the beginning of this video. We got tools so we were able to actually put lashes on. We started out by putting lashes on a mannequin like with a strip lash and then we attached lashes to the strip lash. And that was all cool because the lashes were already like separated it was super easy but then we switched and started doing lashes on our classmates we had to take them off before we left so I can't show you like what the lashes look like on me it was so much different to do it on a real person than to do it on a mannequin because obviously like real people's eyelashes aren't like perfectly aligned and straight they're like crisscross they go all different ways you never know what you're gonna expect but today was my first day like literally putting lashes on and I had a lot of fun it was so cool to see like the process props to like lash technicians out there that is not easy you think it's gonna be so easy and you're like whatever I can just glue a lash to another one but it is so much work and it's so much precision and like it's very hard but for my first day lashing I don't think I did that bad I actually was pretty proud of myself that was just basically my day one vlog I'm actually really excited with how class is going and I'm super excited to go in tomorrow so I will see you guys then Good morning guys, it's 6.30. I woke up kinda late, but I also just wanted to sleep in. I didn't even care how I looked, honestly. As you guys saw yesterday, there's a Starbucks like right near my class, so I came an hour early, basically. So I'm here at Starbucks now. I am so tired today. I guess because I never wake up at five ish ever. So now that I have to do it like four days in a row, my body is like telling me to stop. I'm just so dead. I just got to the hotel where we have our class, so I'm gonna go in. I'm a little early, but it always takes me so long to find the class. So I'm gonna go in now, and I will see you guys soon. My memory finally came back. I really needed that. I was so hungry at class. While I'm on my lunch break, I'm pretty much just gonna tell you guys what we've been doing so far during class. This morning we had a PowerPoint on all of Extreme Lash products, and then we pretty much just jumped right into models. So I wanna insert a quick picture right here. Today I got 13 seamless lashes on both eyes, so that is actually like really, really good progress, and I'm really excited with that. Now, for the second half of the day, I'm gonna be an eyelash model. We get to keep the lashes on today, so when I get out of class, I'm gonna show you guys what they look like on me. I'm back from class now. I have my lashes on. 
So yeah, everyone's doing really good and making really good progress. Um, this is literally only our second day ever of doing lashes, so even to get this amount on is very, very good. Finishing out class today was super easy. I literally just got my um, eyelashes put on. Then we just got like a one-on-one -on -one evaluation with our teachers, so my score was 77 out of 100. I got 13 seamless lashes put on my model on both eyes. So I think that was really good because yesterday I think I only got five and nine so that was an improvement. My teacher's concern for me was just um, proper lash placement. She wants me to be putting the base of the lash on first instead of the curve so that's what I need to work on the next two days. But yeah, that was day two of my class so I guess I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye! <laughs> Hi guys, it's um, day three. Sorry I didn't vlog too much of the day today. I woke up so late. Um, my dad had to even wake me up because I turned off my alarm and then I fell back asleep. Right now, I am actually on lunch break. I already went to class. I did my first model of the day. Um, so far, I did not pass my um, 20 and 20 lashes on each eye to get certified. I only got 14 and 15, but there's still three more chances. So I'm not too worried. I think I'm definitely gonna get it I'm gonna answer a picture of the lashes. I did here So yeah, they look good. I just need to try a little harder and get 20 and 20 on each eye I'm back from class now. I just got done my second model. I'm gonna put a picture right here I got over 20 seamless lashes on her, but somehow I didn't get a passing grade. I think it's because a couple different factors affected that. So um, tomorrow I'm hoping to get a 90. Um, that's all we're going to do tomorrow as well. So um, I'll see you guys then. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited right now. I'm actually just going to leave. I'm a little late again because I oversleep because I'm so tired. But I got up way easier today since it's my last day. So... Let's go to class for the final time. So I just got here at class. Um, today we had to wear all black because we're going to be getting like a class photo. So I'm literally just wearing um, a black sweatshirt because I am tired. So I want to go in now and I'll see you guys on my lunch break. So I passed my class just now. I did Molly's eyelashes. Molly actually was my last model of class and I got 20 eyelashes on each eye so that's a passing number. We're gonna fix them up because they're sparse so a full set would look way fuller than that. Hi sweetie! Oh! <laughs> well that's the end of the vlog so actually no it's not. I'm gonna show you guys what was in my student kit but this is the end of day four so. Yes! Bye! Bye! Hi guys, um, it's been a couple days since the class. I definitely took a couple days off to sleep, but I'm back now to show you guys what was in my school student kit. So obviously the most important thing we got in our kit at school was our tools, Pro Comfort PCC, Pro Comfort PCS, two pairs of the micro spring scissors. We got a pair of the S2S tweezers. Here are how many lashes I have left over after doing about six models in class. Obviously I didn't do full sets because I was just learning, but this is still what I have left over. Two pairs of little strip lashes because this is great practice on like a mannequin if you don't have a model at the moment. I have a pack left over of the cosmetic sponges, a ton left over alcohol prep pads, some multi-purpose wipes, another compact mirror, hand sanitizer. This one smells so good. One square wheel tray, some medicine cups, not that many. I think there's like 10 here. Three packs of the hydrating under eye patches and then one box of the silicone under eye patches. Just kidding, this is actually empty. I just found that out, so none of these. <laughs> Tons of leftover applicator brushes. Two and a half packs of the lint-free applicators. One pack of the long tip applicators. And about one and a half packs of the spoolies. Two lash grids. We got these clocks. I'm not quite sure what they're called. Um. I have no idea, but they just say the temperature, humidity, and the time. And then we finally got our mini fans. I was so excited about this because I wanted this so bad. I don't know why, but look how cute. It's like a mini fan. And then like in between the lashes, you can switch it on and the air comes out here so you can just dry your client's lashes and I just think it's so cute. We also got one airflow fan. I was not expecting to get one of these but that was a nice surprise. So that was everything that I received in my student kit at school. Overall opinion of the class was it was actually really great and informative. My teacher was amazing. She really really knew what she was talking about and she was so helpful. Every step of the way she was there to guide you and give you really great tips so I really like that. Overall I really really love extreme 
Extreme Lashes as a brand. I really like their founder, Joe Maselli. Um, their lashes are great quality. I love their glue. I love all of their products and how easy it is to access them as an Extreme Lash stylist. So if you're looking to join a lash class or get lash certified, I really, really recommend Extreme Lashes. That is the end of this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. It was kind of less of like a fun video and more of like a actually informative video to help you guys out. But I really did enjoy filming this. I had so much fun going to the class and it feels so great to finally be lash certified. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you enjoyed it, of course, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys soon. Bye everyone!